These chargers look exactly like Tesla's V4 superchargers. Same size, same cables, but there's one strange difference. They're branded EV on the move. So why is Tesla hiding here? I'm at one of these new white label Tesla sites. This one's owned by the EG Group. These are popping up all over the UK under the EV on the move name. And here's what you need to know if you pull up to one. White label just means Tesla builds the site, provides the hardware, software, and even maintenance. But another company runs it and sets the price. For EG Group, it's a turnkey solution where Tesla provides 97% uptime guarantee, which is great because we need more reliable charging infrastructure. For Tesla owners, these work just like normal. Your car will navigate here if it's the best one on the route, the battery will preheat, and you just plug in. The only giveaway is the name in the app. Non-Tesla drivers can charge too using the Tesla app, and soon debit card support is coming. And it's not just the UK. BP is spending $100 million to roll these out in the US as well. One catch. Free supercharging no longer works here. There was a temporary loophole for a few months, but now even if you have lifetime free miles, you'll be billed at these EG Group sites. This site has four chargers with room to expand and speeds up to 250 kilowatt. So it's identical to Tesla's own. The only difference is the branding and the cost. At McMurray, you also have a few shops like Co-op, Subway, Greg's, and even a Starbucks across the road. Other sites are even larger than this one. This is a win for EV owners. More sites, Tesla level reliability, and competition that pushes everyone to raise their game. It's also a smart way for Tesla to scale more quickly. If you see EV on the move or another brand on the supercharger, don't panic. It works just the same, but be sure to check the rate in your app because it might be a little higher. Have you tried one of these chargers? Drop your experience in the comments and subscribe for more EV insights and I'll see you in the next one.